All right, fellas. So first things first, let's clear this up. If you are a man who is not ambitious, doesn't have goals that they want to reach, do not have certain milestones, they don't have a certain active lifestyle that they want to have, make an impact in the world, click off this video right now because this video is not for you. This video is for the ambitious men who are looking to build massive things and make a big impact in this world. And the whole point of this video is to explain to you why health is one of the most important things that you need, but it's not for what you think. Everyone says, get jacked, get ripped, build as much muscle as possible, lose the fat, make sure you sleep well, make sure you're healthy. There is a reason for this, and it's not just to sit around and do nothing, right? If, you get, if you're just sitting around and doing, doing nothing, this doesn't apply to you. But if you're looking to build an empire, if you're looking to build a business, the act of building a business is destructive. So the whole point of health is to be able to build reserves so that when you go in to the process of building a business or building a vision, it doesn't have to be a business, anything that's big, you can actually start to use those health reserves to be able to basically build the business. So for example, in the beginning of a business, you're sleeping late, right? You're not having time to go to the gym the way that you do. You kind of fall off. It's very destructive. It decays your body. So the whole point of being healthy, the whole point of being jacked is so you have that reserve. You have that shield. Think about it like a video game. In a video game, you have health XP, right? So you have a certain health bar. You're using up that health bar. You want to be able to maximize the total amount of health that you have. That is the whole point of getting into the gym. It's the whole point of eating healthy or eating clean. That's the whole point of getting seven to eight hours of sleep. It's because you want to build that reserve so that when you have a body like this and you go and you, you grind on a business, you're not working from a low health marker. You're not sitting at here. You're starting here. So as you build that business, as you're, you're pulling late nights, all nighters, as you're, you're getting stressed out because you need to make sales, because you need to grow the business, that health marker is going down. And as it goes down, the whole point of you staying active is to continue to build it back up as it decays, right? So any time that you have to go get seven to eight hours of sleep, you can do it. It replenishes. As you go train, your muscles, everything that you have is supporting you throughout that process. So you're building it back up. As you continue to build the business, you're cutting it back down. Have you ever seen a lot of business leaders that are out of shape, right? The reason why they're out of shape is because the nature of business is very destructive, right? So to combat that destruction, you need a shield. And that is why health is the most important thing that you need to focus on even before you build a business. But even if you are building a business, it acts as a support system. It acts as a shield for you. So the more you continue to build your health, continue to get jacked, continue to get ripped, it's so that you have enough reserve to where when you're destroying your body with business, you're cutting that down. You're now able to sit back and say, I had the reserves for this. I've been sleeping for seven to eight hours for six months or a year. I've been building my body. I have enough muscle reserves to where if I don't work out for a month or two because I'm grinding on this business, because I'm traveling, because I'm doing all these things, because I'm stressed out, I'm not running on E all the time. I'm not in the negatives. The whole point of health is not to get in the negatives when you're building massive things. As a man, there's always going to be chaos in your life. If you're living a fulfilled life, if you're living life on the edge, because that's where you need to be living life, on the edge. You need to make sure that the baseline health is secured, right? Go to the gym four or five times a week. Grind that out, right? Even when you are pushing your health down, keep going to the gym, right? Making sure that you can get, get, get enough sleep when you can, right? Making sure that health can at least creep back up as you go. It's all a support mechanism. It's not to get jacked, to get women. Yes, that, that's a byproduct. But as a man who is ambitious, you have goals to achieve. And those goals are heavy on your body. They literally, they, they cut you down. They knock you down. The failures that you have, it's going to knock you down. But all you can really do is make sure that your health is intact. And when your health is intact, your mental is going to be intact because it all correlates. The minute your, your mental is intact, your health is intact, you're good. You can continue to go through the destructive sport of business. You can continue to go through the destructive sport of building an amazing life. Anybody who's listening to this right now, you want to build a life that is impactful. You want to leave a legacy in this lifetime. And to do that, you need to be at optimal health. Health is not all about just being optimal and having optimization to where 
you can go on the beach and just chill for the rest of your life and just be sipping coconut water and act like a lot of these health gurus out there, right? These health gurus that make health and, and fitness their entire life, they miss the purpose of the whole reason why they're doing it. It's to support them in their journey of building bigger and better things. So that's what I wanted to come here and talk to you guys about because I, I see a lot of people, they're going about fitness and health the wrong way. They have the wrong intentions for it. The minute you transfer your mindset to, I'm building health reserves for a better business, for a better life, so that I can sustain the hits that life is going to hit me with. Because as a man, you will always keep getting hit. You will always keep getting hit. You're always going to feel like you're, you're losing something. You're destroying your body. Your mind is, is being rattled every single day that you wake up and you continue to build. And the only way that you can sustain that for a long period of time is being at the highest level of health that you can possibly be. And that is why we diet. That's why we go and we sleep well. That's why we have active recovery. That's why we hit the sauna. Y'all that like cold plunges, that's why you do it is to build reserves for when things get hard in life and in business and relationships, your body does not decay. You don't decay all the way to the negatives. Because once you're in the negatives, that's when you need to start going to hospital visits. That's when you need to start taking a break from building and taking care of yourself. You want to be at a maximum capacity. Right now, I built myself to where if I have three months of going hard, pulling all-nighters, sleeping late, it's going to affect me. But I'm not going to go into the negatives because I've already built 10 years of health reserves. I've built 10 years of having a healthy body, a healthy mind, so that when things go bad, when things are getting, when I'm getting hit left and right, my health markers are going down, but they're also not going down fast enough because I've already built that resilience. That is the whole point of health and fitness. That is the whole reason why we go to the gym. That's why we, we train ourselves. We build these calluses so that we can go through war. We can go through life, which is always going to be war as a man. If you're not, if you're living life on the edge and you're going as hard as you can and trying to hit your potential, you, your health markers are going to go down. That's a fact. But they can always get built back up. And the more you put in the work, the more you stay consistent with it, the less it cuts down. The le the, every damage you get is like this. Have you ever seen that? Somebody who's strong, they have armor in a video game. I used to play RuneScape, so I know this. You, you, you start getting cut down less, right? Like one 100 point damage only hits you like this. But if you're weak and you're frail, and you haven't built those reserves, you haven't built that health marker, 100 point hit can be like this to you. So you wanna make sure that you have that resiliency, you have the cushion to be able to really survive during times of, of hardship, when you're going through financial hardship, when you're going through relationship hardships, when you're going through business hardships to where you have to make decisions, you're stressed out, you're not sleeping, you're not being able, you can't go to the gym this week because, well, you had a lot of meetings and you literally can't find the time because from sun up to sundown, you're working all day because that's the nature of business. I know a lot of people say you can build a lifestyle business and just relax. Yeah, when it's on autopilot. But most of you, most of you guys that are watching, you're probably either starting out or you're in that phase of trying to get from zero to one, that zero to one phase is the most painful phase that anybody can go through and not many people can survive. The only people who survive are the people who are extremely healthy, extremely fit, and actually took the time to build their reserves. So the whole point of this video is for me to tell you, build those health reserves. Make sure that you're resilient. Make sure that you have that shield up so that when you get hit during this process, you can stay alive and you can continue to build and you have that sustainability and you don't die. That's the whole point of health. So you don't die, but not die when it comes to like in your grave, die when it comes to, man, I gotta go check into a hospital. Man, I gotta, I gotta take a break in my business, right? Oh, I gotta put a pause on life because my health is bad. We don't wanna get there. That's danger zone, that's red zone. And when you're, when you're in the negatives, it's even worse. So make sure that you stay healthy, make sure that you get jacked, but don't do it for superficial reasons. Do it for this reason, because when you do it for this reason, it becomes more impactful. You stay on it longer because you understand the long-term benefits of it, not the short-term benefits, right? Yeah, it's cool to get women. Yeah, it's cool to, for everyone to just gawk at you when you walk into a grocery store 
or having people come up to you and you kind of feel like a celebrity because you're in shape. I've, I have that. I get that all the time. But at the end of the day, that doesn't matter. What matters is you're building something to where you can be resilient and you can actually go after your destiny. That's the whole point. And once you understand this, health becomes something that's very useful to you. It becomes a priority. So make sure you're thinking about this when you're when you're going to the gym, when you're thinking, man, I don't really feel like eating eating my eating my macros today, or I don't feel like hitting enough protein today. I don't feel like drinking um, a gallon of water a day if that's something that you do, or the ample amount of water that you need, right? Make sure you think about that because that's going to make you go harder in it. That's going to make you do more so that you can stay in the game as long as possible. Business is all about how long can you stay in the game consistently. Even when you get hit, business is like this. It's never like this. So when you're going like this, how long can you stay doing that to where you go all the way up? That is the whole reason why we do this. So think about that. It's a super important video. This will change your whole perspective of health, fitness, all that. I'm not here to preach it to you so that you can just get girls. I'm here to allow for you to understand how you can use it in a way that benefits your life in the long term and allows for you to live the most impactful life possible. Because as a man, it doesn't matter if you live 100 years. If you lived 100 years and did not make an impact on this planet, you've wasted 100 years of your time. If you only lived 50 years and you made a huge impact on society, you did something to where your name is remembered from generation to generation to generation, that is a fulfilled life. That is a worthwhile life. More than living 100 years of doing absolutely nothing. So I hope this rang in you guys' ear. I'm going to keep making videos like this because I know you guys need to hear this stuff. I have a very different perspective when it comes to health, fitness, when it comes to mindset, when it comes to even business, right? And this is something that mainstream won't tell you because they tell you generic things. I'm telling you things that are unique because I'm living this on a day-to-day -day basis. I'm doing what I'm saying for you to do. So take this, internalize it, and check me out for the next video. Again, comment, subscribe. Let me know if this video is impactful to you. Share it with friends who are going through the same journey. We're here for a good time and a long time. So let's make this impactful and let's keep grinding. Stay up.